So another question I get asked frequently is why does every insurance company have a different rate and how can I find the best one or the cheapest one for me? And the reality is, or the honest answer is, is that the insurance company you find today with the cheapest rate won't be the same tomorrow. Every insurance company uh, follows rates with the state and they have lots of deviation factors that are driving history. All of these different factors um, associated with you and your car and they vary right and they, they change I want to give you some practical advice or practical recommendations on things to look for to make sure you're getting the best bang for your buck with your insurance the first thing to consider is your deductible a deductible is the amount of money that you're on the hook for before the insurance company pays anything so in the event of a $5,000 claim, if your deductible is 500, you'll be responsible for the first 500 and the insurance company will pay the 4,500 on top of that. So here's a little trick. Your comprehensive deductible doesn't have a massive impact on your premium amount compared to your collision deductible. If you change just your comprehensive deductible down from 500 to 250 or 250 to 100 or 100 to zero, or even 500 to zero, ask your insurance agent or have a look at how much that increases your premium by. My guess is it isn't gonna be very much and it decreases your liability significantly in event of a claim. So for a couple dollars a month or 20 to 30 dollars annually, you could save up to $500 in the event of a claim. So the second item to look for is first accident forgiveness or accident forgiveness. And what that means is that they're not gonna uh, take into consideration the claim that you may have had in that last policy period. This is huge, so bear with me and let me explain. A massive rating factor with an auto insurance policy is your driving history. An insurance language is a program in North Carolina called SDIP points. And they rate an accident or a violation on a scale of one to 12. One being the least, 12 being the highest. Well, in case of an accident, and you have the minor accident, you could be a one on that scale, the minimum it would increase your insurance is by 30% annually. And that stays on your record for three years. So take a look, see if your provider offers it, may help your premium in the future in case of an accident. The third item is don't just shop online. Go speak with your local insurance agent. Quotes are free. They will have various different options or various different markets that are able to shop on your behalf to give you the best options. And they have lots of different options like diminishing deductibles and uh, first accident forgiveness and multi-policy discounts. So they're the the three top things I would say in, in making sure you're getting the best bang for your buck and your, your auto insurance. Um, if you have any questions, feel free, give me a call, send me an email, I'd be happy to help.